Hello coders. In this video, I am going to explain you first data structure of pandas, pandas series. If you are directly watching this video, then I request you to first watch my previous video. So it will become very easy to follow this video. Now, what is pandas series? Pandas series is 1D labeled array. Series can hold heterogeneous values like integer, float, string, etc. Pandas series is one column of pandas data frame. Now, here you can see the pandas data frame in a tabular format. So here, how many series are there? Three. One, two and three. Series one, series two and series three. So pandas series is one column of a pandas data frame. Now, here you can see pandas series can be created using Python list, tuple, dictionary, numpy array and also with scalar value. Now, first pandas series using Python list. Now here you can see I have imported numpy as np and pandas as pd. In place of np and pd you can use any string but this is the professional way to import the different libraries. Import numpy as np and import pandas as pd. Now here I have created python list with 5 values 11, 22, 33, 44 and 55. Now here you can see I have used pandas method series. And please note that here S is capitalized. Then here I have passed the list one to this method. Now here you can see pandas series is displayed. And here please note that indexes are automatically created by pandas. Next pandas series using tuple. Now here you can see again I have imported numpy as np and pandas as pd. Now here you can see I have created tuple with five values. 11, 22, 33, 44 and 55. Now in series method of pandas I have passed this tuple variable tuple 1. Now you can see pandas series is created and here indexes are automatically created by pandas. Pandas series using python dictionary. Now here you can see again I have imported numpy as np and pandas as pd and here I have created python dictionary with variable dict1. Dictionary is nothing but key values pair. Here 0, 1, 2, 3 and 4 are keys. 11, 22, 33, 44 and 55 are values. Now here you can see I have passed this dict1 to series method. Again just to remind here s is capitalized. Now you can see panda series is created. Here please note that these keys are become indexes of this panda series that you can see over here in this example I have used a 1 3 5 7 and 10 as a key values so here you can see indexes are created using this key values so 1 3 5 7 and 10 become indexes of this panda series panda series using numpy now here you can see here actually required to import numpy as np and import pandas as pd. Now here you can see I have created Bundy array with 5 elements 11, 22, 33, 44 and 55. Now again I have passed this numpy variable to series method of pandas. Then you can see over here panda series is created and again these indexes are created automatically by pandas. Next series using scalar value. So now here you can see pd.series here I have passed the scalar value 11 and I have created manually index with index parameter 0, 1, 2, 3 and 4 that we will discuss in detail in the next video. But now please remember this only one value 11 and then using index parameter I have created indexes 0, 1, 2, 3 and 4 total 5 indexes. Then you can see this scalar value is replicated according to the number of indexes here is 5 so 11 is replicated 5 times now let i show you this practically in the jupyter notebook so as i said panda series can be created using python list tuple dictionary numpy array and scalar value now let i show you first panda series using python list so let i first import pandas as pd now let i create first python list with 11 22 33, 44 and 55, 5 elements. Now let I create variable x 
and pd dot series please note that here s is capitalized and here we have to pass list one now you can see over here panda series is created using python list please note that here indexes are created automatically by pandas so now this python list contains heterogeneous values like some string and also we can pass the floating point values now as i said python series can hold heterogeneous values now here you can see panda series is created using python list with heterogeneous values like string floating point and integers now next panda series using tuple so now again let i import pandas as pd actually not required because i already imported above now let i create the tuple so we have to write the values in parentheses 11 22 33 44 and 55 you can use any other values now again let i take x is equal to pd dot series please remember this here s is capitalized then we have to pass this tuple one now you can see over here panda series is created using tuple please note that indexes are created automatically by pandas next panda series using python dictionary so now let i create python dictionary here again and again not required to import pandas spd because we already imported above now see python dictionary is key value pair so now here is key and value key and value key and value key and value again key and value that you can use let i write 5 key and 55 as value now x is equal to pd dot series method then you can pass this dict one now you can see over here panda series is created using python dictionary here key become indexes of this panda series 0 1 2 3 4 and 5 that you can see over here now let i change the value of these keys to 1 3 any value 5 7 10 and 12 now let i write pd dot series then let me pass dict one now you can see panda series is created indexes are created using this key value 1 3 5 7 10 and 12 this key is become actually index of this panda series now panda series using numpy so let me first import numpy as np not required to import pandas as pd because we already imported it above now let i create one variable numpy so np dot array let me create the 1d array using five elements 11 22 33 44 55 you can use any other values now x is equal to pd dot series let me pass this numpy now here you can see panda series is created using nd array numpy array now panda series using scalar value so now here pd dot now let i use one scalar value 11 you can use any other value also we require to pass index parameter let i pass 0 1 2 3 4 and 5 now you can see panda series is created using scalar value same value is replicated six times because how many indexes are there six zero one two three four and five total six so now these are the different ways to create the panda series using python list tuple dictionary numpy array and scalar value thank you thank you for watching